Hey, what's going on, people? Hope you're doing well. Tony here from LearnAutoBodyAndPaint.com. Um, I only have about 22% on my phone streaming live right now, so if it cuts out, I am so sorry about that. Uh, but if you're just tuning in, please let me know that you can hear me and you can see some videos by just commenting on the chat really quickly. Um, let me know that you can hear me and you see the video here. All right, so we're starting to get some uh, chats in here. It says, yes. Again, guys, uh, just letting you know that I am running very low on my cell battery here, but I just wanted to use this tonight uh, to jump on. Uh, we have a new system here that I wanna show you and we're gonna be creating a package, um, not only for VIPs, but for people who watch this channel on getting a alternate PPS system. PPS system is very, very expensive and we're working on another solution. Thanks guys for giving me your feedback. Um, I see you right here tuning in. Um, just type in the chat really quickly guys if uh, everything is good. I think, I think we're good. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Okay guys, so like I was saying, I, I am actually testing out um, a few different variations here. Tony, hi from Maui. What's up, Johnny? I see ya. Ray, I see ya. Um, and I'm going to kind of go over quickly what I got going on here. <clears throat> and, um, and we'll let you go today. So who's on watching for the first time today? Any newbies first time watching us go live here? What's up, Tony Lagusa, L Laguesa? Okay, so this is the PPS Cup System Alternate. Um, here is a new version. It's a snap style. Um, I'm testing it right now. D Cup PPS, same stuff. Yep, it's also cheaper. I do have the D Cup System. It's just too big, and it it really I don't like it at all. It's it kind of sucks. This is the D Cup System right here. Um, I got some of the, uh, the, the liners here and the plastic uh, pieces that go on the top here. But let me show you what I got going here. <clears throat> so this is a brand new system uh, that's basically a clip-on style. So let me actually put this on a stand here really quickly. Yeah, guys, if you didn't give a like yet, give a like really quickly. So if we take a look at this, it is basically a system kind of like this here. You got your 125 micron or 200 micron filter, whatever you want to do. Uh, they say that if you're shooting with waterborne, you want to use 125 micron. Uh, Solvent-based paints, you could use a 200 um, because it's, it's a little finer. Uh, the paint is thinner, but two, 125 micron isn't enough for everything. So, uh, I think that's way more than you need. So the filter is right on this right here. Uh, pretty cool. And then it's super simple because you just pop the liner in and then you put this in and then you just clip, clip, and you're done. Uh, and I've just been testing this for leaks it doesn't leak, but I'm telling the factory that they should put four clips just to be sure. Two clips doesn't leak, but I'm thinking if they could do four clips, that would be like extra and I'd like it a lot better. So, so here's the deal. <clears throat> here is the mini system right here, okay? And this is the large. It just pops on and pops on, right, and twists. And take a look at this adapter, totally brand new. It is a special high grade plastic material, all right? It's not your aluminum. If you look at the aluminum, not aluminum, the steel ones that they sell and they have out there, it's probably, you can get them for like 18 to $22 I've seen them sell for. This is gonna sell for a lot more and it's cheaper than that. Um, yeah, I think they'll break over time, but 
I think these will break over time, just like the Ziploc containers. You ever use those household Ziploc containers? I have a ton of them at home that I use every day for the food storage. And over time, they get weak and they pop off. But I mean, the whole system is disposable. That's why you go buy a new set after you use them. I'm sure this will last a while. You know what I mean? Cause, and you also get a bunch of these in the, uh, in the pack anyway. You get like 10 of these. And you get uh, 20, 20 uh, inner liners and 20 uh, filters. So it's, uh, it's pretty cool. Well, actually, the filters are on here. So it might actually come with a new one on every, on every deal. I don't know yet. Um, I'm in talks with the manufacturer. We're trying to get an awesome system put together for you guys. Inexpensive and something that works really well. So my question to you guys is... What sizes would you like? I'm not 100% sure yet on this plastic adapter here. Um, I'm you know, in the process of testing it out. Right now I got water. I got water in here. This is not clear coat or anything. Right? It's just completely complete water. And I've been testing it, you know, shooting water out of here. I've been, I've been having it out for pretty much all day today. No leaks at all. No leaks in here. Right? But what I think would be good, just in case, did anybody on here ever have problems with leakage with the PPS system or the decups? I used to have some issues with the decups system as far as leakage goes. Did anybody else have problems? What's up, Mr. Vega? Vega? Anybody have any leakage? Well, what I'm thinking is just to be on the safe side right? What you could do is wrap a little Teflon tape around here, little Teflon tape, and then pop it in to this, to this plastic uh, adapter here. You know, that's what I'm thinking. I mean, I haven't had any leaks, but I'm thinking it would be a, a perfect seal because the, the last thing you really want is a clear coat or a paint drop on your hood. Looks like I didn't have this tightened up enough, but you get what I'm saying? That's the last thing that you need to have is, I mean, clear coat, not bad, but base, base coat is kind of an issue because you're like, oh crap, you gotta let it dry, sand it on or rebase it. But clear coat, I mean, clear coat, you could also color sand and buff it out. But here's my question. Let me get, let me get down to the to the nitty gritty. If I were to put a, t a package together, what cup sizes would you want? We got the standard, this is the standard, the 600 milliliter, which is 20 ounces, a little over 20 ounces, okay? 600 ml. We got the 800 ml, looks like it can go up to 900. But we got 800 ml, the conversion is basically 27 ounce. This is pretty big. This is a little smaller than the thousand milliliter here. Okay. God damn mosquitoes. Uh, and then we got the 350 milliliter, which is the eight ounce, not eight ounce, 11.83 11, 11 ounce. And then we got the little 160 milliliter which is 5.41 ounce. And let me show you what that looks like on the minigun, guys. <clears throat> so here is the minigun, right? This is the minigun. And we got the, the little five, five ounce cup here, four and 4.41. Pretty cool setup if you ask me. It basically, replaces the this is a 120 this is a 120 milliliter four ounce standard cup that comes on the atom 16s here but if you replace it with this cup system you get a little bit more and it's a nice size but here's the cool thing you could instantly pop this off and put on an 11 and a half ounce system just like that super quickly Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The liners are very, very expensive. I am trying to work a deal with this company and put together a 
nice, affordable package for you guys. So, th I mean, this is what I'm working on, right? I want to provide some awesome products to the auto body community. Um, and here's the other, the cool thing here. Now watch, this is 11 and a half ounce, 350 milliliter on the mini gun, right? If we want, we could go ahead and just go boom. And now we got 600, 600 milliliter on it right here. Yeah, I agree guys, the systems are freaking expensive and I am working hard. I've been working on this deal with this company here for the past two months, roughly, give or take. I do like the collar system better personally because I know I get a good seal. This is, this is the new version, but I don't like the two snaps. If they can do four snaps on it, I might, I might like this version, but it's only two snaps. My battery's getting low. Anyway, um, get, let's, let's do a vote really quickly. Uh, let's do a, a vote. Let's do a vote really quickly, guys. 800 milliliter, 600 milliliter. Okay. Oh God. Oh shit. <laughs> Sorry guys. Um, here's the 600 ml. Um, 350 and 180. What is this? 180, 160. So basically five, five and a half ounce, 11.8, 20.28, 27. This is the big daddy. This is the big mama right here. So you guys like the huge one. You guys like the big mama. 11 point, this is a good size. Yeah, so I mean, it's pretty much, yeah, holds more product, I agree. A few mediums, a couple of 800s. Would you guys be interested in a pack of basically getting all of them? All of them in one pack? Or pretty much, Two sizes. You know, like maybe the eight, the 800 and the 600, you know, or maybe the 600 and this size or three. Would you want all three sizes? 800, 600 and 350 or, or all of them? I'm just trying to figure out what would be a good starter pack I don't trust the two snaps though. What if one snaps off? Yeah, I agree. I agree. They have, I mean, check these out. We have the snap versions. They come in a multitude of colors as well. You know, but I mean, the colors really don't matter. But I'm, I'm not sure. I think this will last a long time. Just like the Ziplocs. I mean, I've had those Ziploc food storage containers in my house for a couple of years and now they're starting to tear off and wear off. Um, but you know, it is what it is and the filters right on here. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking because the filter is on here, we're probably going to get just as many of these as we get liners. Do you know what I mean? Because each liner is pretty much disposable after you do one system in it, right? You throw it out. I mean, you could wash it out if you want. You could actually do base, rinse this out quick if you want to, and then mix up your clear and use it for clear coat. That can be done. I don't see any problems with that. Yes, with adapter, obviously. Now we have a hundred aluminum adapters coming in. I'm getting, I'm getting aluminum and adapters in stock, but they actually hooked me up with this PVC material adapter. Let me show you. It's a new, it's a new adapter, basically. Um, and it's like a plastic material. I'd prefer a few caps and a ton of liners if you have to sway with them. Four snaps would be safe on the twisted. Twisted one seems great. I agree. I agree on the twist twisted one. But here is the plastic version. I like it because it's lightweight. It seems like a very hard 
durable plastic, to be honest. And it won't damage your gun either. And it doesn't seem like you can strip it. It's very heavy duty. You know, you just give it a good, good hand tighten and you're good to go. I think as long as you don't scratch the inside here and gouge it, you won't have any leak issues. And this is the new version. It's gonna be like less than half price, I would, I would assume, than the, uh, the $20 adapter. They're like 19 bucks, the adapters. 19 to 22, I've seen them sell for. Um, of course not. The solvents will not damage this adapter. It won't. It's just like, I mean, it's not gonna be soaking in solvent all year long. You're gonna be using it, the solvents, the, you know, this is pretty much all the way in. There's really not much solvent touching it, to be honest. You know, and this is the system right here. You know, it looks really good to me. And if it wears out, throw it out and get a new one. I mean, it's not that. That's more than the cup adapters are 15. Yeah, well, I know they're like 15 to 20 bucks, the uh, PPS and, and uh, the cups in that area. I can't find my the cups adapter. I've been looking for it. Can't freaking find it. Um, anyway, guys, I want to thank you for the feedback. Um, stay tuned. I'm in the process of putting together an awesome starter package um, in, a, in a box kit that we can promote on Zula.com. It's going to be really, really cool. We're going to create a multitude of sizes, a uh, multitude of, you know, a, a bunch of liners. Um, and we're trying to price it a lot more cheaper than the cups or PPS because that is just ridiculous pricing they got there. And um, we're looking to to, to, to change it. Yeah, I get it. I get it. F575 GTC. I mean, it's, it's too much. It's too much. Um, so anyway, guys, it's Tony here from Learn Auto Body and Paint Thursday night. Uh, I want to say what's up. I'm in the process here. Give you a quick update on the project here. We got the disc brake system. We got brand new shocks in the front, brand new shocks in the back are already installed. Brand new power booster system. Uh, we got, we're gonna be doing all, all the bushings on the front end, all brand new bushings. We're gonna be undercoating. We did some testing of some new undercoating here called Tight Seal. I like it very much. So we're gonna be doing a complete undercoat job in here. <clears throat> That's awesome, a slingshot, awesome, awesome. And then we're gonna put this front end together and then drop the motor in, drop the motor in, um, hopefully before it gets cold. I got the aluminum radiator just came in. Uh, we have everything, motor mounts, we got everything waiting to, to, uh, for this project here. It's gonna be really nice when it's done. Um, yeah, I do collision repair. I do everything. I do complete restorations, uh, just, you know, little by little, you know, you get it done. I used to do a lot of frame work back in the day, but I don't have a frame machine now. Uh, we got a complete stereo system. Got my Pioneer system there. This thing's going to be pimp. We got a backup camera that's going in it. I like that purple. Does it have flake in it? Yes, it has uh, flake in it. Um, my wife bought me a new little tractor here. We're actually going to be doing something really crazy with this um, next week. I, I already got the paint. I got the candy paint. We're going to be putting a custom metal flake and candy paint job on this thing. And you guys are going to love it. It's going to be all in VIP for you. Step by step. It's going to be pimp. Um, then this is, this is going to be the next project after that. And we're also going to be finishing up this gas tank that's been sitting for a while uh, before it starts getting cold. We're also probably gonna do this gas tank here. Hey, what's up, Tom? I see ya. I see ya, I see ya, I see ya. Yeah, it works really good. It works really damn good. Nitrous shot on the mower. <laughs> Hell yeah. So, So anyway, guys, 
Um, I'm in the process of taking the upper and lower control arms apart, taking the spindle off right now, the hub here, and then we're gonna be putting the brand new disc brake conversion kit on, working on it here. And um, all of this is gonna be in VIP as well, slowly uh, taking all the video, video footage on all of this. So, all right guys, it's Tony here from LearnAutoBodyAndPaint.com. If you haven't liked the video, give a quick like, and I'll see you on next week, Thursday. We're gonna go live, and I'll keep you updated um, on this because this is gonna be an awesome package we're gonna to put together at a really good price point. You know, um, that's the main goal. You know, I wanna give you high quality and a good, good product at a good price point. So if you guys haven't checked out the Atom X27, check this gun out. It's super, super, super freaking awesome. I love it. Um, this is the low volume, low pressure version for clear coat. And this is the, this is the base coat version right here, X27. Um, anyway, it's Tony here, guys. I'll talk to you later. I'm about to do some new spray gun reviews as well. I also have a uh, the AccuSpray, 3M AccuSpray system coming in. We'll probably be getting that next week, so I'll be doing a review on that as well. Um, so yeah, so that's pretty much it. Hi, right, guys. Tony here. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel, comment down below, let me know what you think of everything, and I'll see you guys next week, Thursday night, about the same time. Have a great weekend. It's, they say it's going to be raining here this weekend, here in Dallas, uh, Texas, but whatever. Um, other than that, hope everyone's doing well. I'll talk to you soon, guys. Have a great night, and if you want to get free auto body training, get a free book, click right over here later on. There'll be a link where you can learn more about that and VIP. Have a good night, VIP guys. Talk to you later. Cheers. Bye. My phone is about to die. We got like 2% left. It's going to crack out. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Aloha, guys. Thank you, guys. eBay.